Pick a point on the globe. Any point. And Maersk won't be far away. Transporting the cargoes that connect traders across the world. Securing the supply of energy to keep our world moving forward. Building businesses with local partners. Creating jobs. Helping the economy grow. Many places. One way of doing business. We are Maersk. And we're preparing for new times and new challenges. Trade has truly become global. Every day, mountains have to be moved from one side of the world to the other. To the most remote corners. To the busiest centers. New times. New brands, new markets. Everywhere, reliable supply is paramount if you want to stay in business. How does Maersk Line help Chinese companies reach global markets? China has aspired to go global. What we have been seeing over the last few years is that there are a lot more Chinese uh, companies selling goods on their own labels, and they're also setting up manufacturers abroad and selling goods directly to outside as well. China does not want to be only the world's manufacturer, but want to be known for its national brands. And this is where Merslight can add a lot of values for the customers in making sure that whenever their cargoes are shipped to, where they're going to import their raw materials, we always have a reliable product available to them and consistent service that they can use. Medea is a class example of the Chinese uh, brands going global. They still produce a lot of the goods uh, for the international brands, but they're also selling a lot of the goods in their own brands as well. They're also setting up uh, factories in other countries, like the one that's set up in Latin America. For the Chinese brands to expire to become a global brand, first of all, they need a global reach. This is where Marisla is very strong at. We have uh, extensive knowledge in emerging markets. Merce line has always aspired to be the most reliable carriers, but with a very extensive local knowledge. So in that sense, you enjoyed the global reach of the largest container shipping lines, but also the local touch. Eight out of 10 people live in growth markets. Their future depends on building strong and stable economies. But how do you create an economy today that's prepared for tomorrow? It starts with establishing trade connections to the world. Harbors and hubs, with infrastructure and logistics to support them. And people, local people, with the right motivation, the right skills, to make these gateways work, like clockwork. 
APM terminals operate more than 60 ports and terminals worldwide. To see what difference they're making, let's visit Kai Mep in Vietnam. The terminal plays a very important role in Vietnam. It helps make Vietnam more competitive, so it makes me proud to be part of something this big. So this is far more than just a job. I'm connecting people, businesses and countries with my country. Just to give you an idea, more than 30 million containers are passing through Merck's terminal worldwide in just one year. A single container can carry the yearly consumption of noodles for more than 3,000 people. That gives you the picture of the magnitude of our operation. We lift as a team because there's no room for mistakes. So safety is top priority. That's why we have special focus on safety and human resources. We all need to share the same values to understand each other so we can work as one. Right now, Vietnam exports twice what we import, but that's changing. Trade is bringing prosperity to my country. Soon the ships coming in will be just as full as ships that are leaving. I believe what we're doing here will be a great help for our country and our children will benefit from the prosperity that trade brings to us with the development of terminals like this one. Nature is a force to be reckoned with to be respected, to be treated with care. She gathers her resources in the most remote environments. Nature challenges us to drill deeper, go further, to find ways to do business safely and responsibly under the most challenging conditions imaginable. The oil fields of tomorrow are located in the toughest places on Earth and license to operate them is only granted to the very best. How do you meet these challenges when you're working for mask drilling operations in Malaysia? Safety is part of efficiency. When it comes to efficiency, it means that we are doing our job the fastest we can, the safest we can. This also means that the customer can spend least money to complete the job in the fastest time. As a safety training officer, my main responsibility is to make sure that employees are always put safety as a top priority. We need to tell them the set of rules that they are expected to comply with and also to show them around the ring. The zero incident culture means we are not injuring any personnel. We do not have any spill to the environment and we directly will add values to our customer. That is something that I'm very proud of. The construction of this Excel rig is very exciting to me. At one time, it could be up to a thousand people working on the rig at the same time, every single day. And, and that is amazing to me. For me, safety is my own personal responsibility. I really say this from my heart because this is not only for myself, but also for all the employees on the rig. And then at the end of the day, we just want to go back to family, just as we come to the rig without any injury or harm. When you're drilling in the world's most precarious environments, safety is simply good business. But you can't rely on yesterday's technology. You have to invent your own. The new generation of XLE rigs constructed here are the safest, most efficient and reliable equipment ever developed for the oil industry. Ready today for the oil fields of tomorrow. Many local enterprises have customers spread worldwide. 
Yet bringing precious goods safe and on time from producers to consumers is never an easy task. But no matter how remote the location, if there is a road, there is a connection to the international highways of trade. All it takes is a reliable partner to secure the deliveries. Damco is one of the world's largest freight companies. How do they manage the complexity and still create value for each of their customers? We uh, specialize in providing end-to-end -end logistic solutions. For example, our customers find a right uh, manufacturer or supplier in countries like India, China, Vietnam, and then they call them to move their uh, cargo. We manage and develop their entire supply chain, including from uh, importing raw materials to exporting finished products, not only to the port, but to uh, their distribution centers, their stores, or to their final customers. Shanghai is a very interesting city. Everything runs really fast. Uh, people work very fast, people talk fast. Very motivating place for our people to work. We believe that uh, uh, no two customers are really alike. So every single customer needs their own tailor-made solutions. We really work very closely with our customer, try to understand their business, and then come up with customized solutions to fit their specific business. Wherever you meet Mask, you will find people dedicated to making a difference. Because as the world changes, one thing remains constant. We are heading towards a better future.